Welcome in the spread. This is Todd Ashen. We're gonna go over some tips and techniques on how to catch striped bass. Like this beautiful fish. There you go. I've got one ounce of weight on right now with this much flow, probably have to go to two to get it down there where you need to be. Right on the bottom, you know. The quicker you can get it on the bottom, the better your chances are of hooking up up there. Like right now, I'm just tinging, just barely popping it across the bottom right here. Um, typically this far, but with this much flow, you can, like that right there, you can catch them this far back. Now, if they got slower flow, then you won't make as far this far of a drift you'll just go maybe to the end of that wall before you come back go back up but with the heavier flow it keeps them active further down been a while since I caught a fish. <laughs> I don't know how to act. Popped him off. Quick release, but that's typically how you do it. Yeah, your fish will set right in the first 30 yards of the rough water. You know, the bait gets churned up, gets spit out, so they'll just set in behind the rocks, pick it up as it comes across their face. So you'll take one to two ounces, depending on the flow, throw it in there behind the bulls, and as you're drifting out, you know, that bait just comes right across the fish's face and you're hooked up. As you can see, cast out, drift in the rough water. Everybody kind of gets in a line on the calm side, comes back up. Kind of take turns, you know. If you try to run up the center, then you're going to be hitting people that's drifting down, so. Little method to the madness, I guess you could say. Yeah. Like a 
Just pull it. salt. Keeps the bait happy. Without that, they'll go. They'll be red nosed in like an hour. <laughs>